A clan left unchecked can be your worst nightmare. Left to their own devices, they had grown at a ridiculous rate. We were just a village, a group of friends having fun. But they were quickly becoming our greatest threat. We didn't plan this the way it turned out. The arrogance of what we did, the message we wanted to send, for they would never forget the day it met my Patreon village. This is the story of my village, something I do with my fans over my Discord every month. It's full on, action packed, full of highs, full of lows, it doesn't disappoint. And of course, I do something outrageous whilst deep in a clan base. If you ever want to be part of one of these, be sure to come and join my Discord. Right now, we're just starting up, looking for an area to live, and we're just building our starter base. As you can see, our theme this time is cars. Let me know in the comments what car you would be, or what is your favorite car? Are they home? I believe, no, they're, they're, they're out roaming right now. That's why, that's why we could just take this out real quick. We could crash, crash the scrap alien into the door, burn it down. The area we lived in was hot. It was full of groups. And we'd come across this base that had two helis and we wanted to burn the door down with their heli. Yeah, go on, Dodge. Crash it in perfectly, mate. They're coming out. I'm dead. They have two wood doors, boys. Killed him. Coming down. Coming down. Damn it, this fucking thing was full health. Guys, guys, we can go... I need. Boys, we, we can go right deep. Behind. Oh, I'm I... behind, behind, behind. Come behind. They're coming back. They're going to come back. Now, what we really needed were fire arrows to burn their bags and we could pick out the wall, but we don't have that kind of time. We need a way to get in quickly and we're really under time pressure here. I'm dead. I'm here, I've got their fuel. As you can see, it's a bloodbath. We kept getting rolled on by other groups and we really were struggling to go deep, but I fancied one more try. Guys, I'm one door deep. Yeah, it's clear. Fucking wolf. Fucking wolf! I kid you not, that little footage there was the closest we came to any kind of content. So, with that in mind, and with us really struggling to get anywhere anytime soon, we packed up our stuff and we moved to somewhere we thought we'd have a better chance. And then start grading the foundation to send that. Yeah. So with our villagers, the first thing that always goes up is a community base. Somewhere all the players can come and place bags and have somewhere to spawn that's safe. And then we have combined workbenches and things like that, furnaces. And then we help each other get their bases up and running. Then we build a compound around the whole thing. And then we have our village. And that's how we do it every time. Right, it's actually beginning to look like a village. I like, I like this a lot. We heard someone Ioka raiding in the distance, so we went to check it out. We broke in. Killed one. Oh shit. He's tagged with Yoko. One's down, one's down. Kill the other one. Oh no, I didn't. Two down, two down. One more me. Kill me, bro. Hold in front of the door. All right, killed him. All right, let's, should, we, should we finish this eco raid? This is the great thing about village. Sora then logs on and he says he's got a flamethrower, so he brings it over to us so we can speed it up. Base is open, setting. Nice. Three bags, okay. Just a TC in here and two box, three boxes. Let's have a look. Potatoes, Mel, hatchet, nothing, Revy, that was beyond shit. Alright, full TC. 
Never underestimate a base by their boxes because that tool cupboard can always be so juicy. The stuff I've found in the past always destroy a tool cupboard, even on a decayed base. We fast forward a little bit and the village is beginning to take shape. One of the boys has a heli tower. We still don't have a compound and then the heli comes out. You need more bullets, Avenger? Or just let me know. I will. All right. Get a quarter of it. I got zero. Oh, no. I, oh, it's, oh. oh. Okay, the snake is going up. for it. Are you AK? Oh, okay, yeah, you are. That was AK, yeah, right? yeah, yeah. Two ones, if it's C4, we should just blow straight into this base it landed on. First box, attachments. Second box, two C4, three box. The AK is you. Third box, five, five, six bullets. What? Oh, we have this is Metal face mask. You can have it. I already have what? one. Come over it. The heli loot enabled us to go raiding and Slime had a target, so he asked for the villagers to back him up in case he gets countered. And then we went up over the valley and there was a base that was overlooking the valley and they would always shoot down on us. Unfortunately, I wasn't online when this happened, so I'm just taking their word for it. But that's the reason he wanted to raid them, because they were just constantly, constantly shooting down on the village. Whose AK is that? It's oh, ours. That's, that's ours, that's ours, that's ours. Yeah. There's a kid, they just came up and checked and ran You got TC. All right, guys. You got door slime? Anyone got door ready on them? Bring TC up, guys. Somebody come with TC. Uh, I... They go back or is he still high? Oh, I see him. I see him. They're running. Yeah. It's not a bad race, slime. Not so far. 5,000 sulfur. Se oh, hang on. 7,000 sulfur. 5,000. Oh, oh, that guy yeah. And the low grade. You shit tons of low grade. Very good raid. What did TC have for so I can show stream? Come on, demon. <laughs> Literally. Yeah, and then... It, Twice. It's nothing. <laughs> but slime, it's all about the uh, low grade, man. It was an easy enough raid and a quick eviction. And the way slime did this is he took what he needed for himself and then let all the other villagers that help have the scrap. And this way we help each other all the time and no one screws each other over. I took it upon myself to be the one responsible for upkeeping and maintaining the community base, which you can see here, we would come and gather and discuss raids and so on and so forth, and also have a little bit of fun. Yeah, 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 yeah. Complete noob. <laughs> Next raid was mine, and I took some of the boys to assist me. I'd found an eco raid opportunity, and I'd seen a sleeper inside, and of course, the eco raid is always through the windows, so I went and did this. Oh, I need to read. I should have brought ladders. I just realized. Fuck. <laughs> I just run into these. Come up. I'm deep. They pull our bases for Can you also bring me um, a saw for me, please? Because my AK is going to break. And if you find yourself in a situation here, like I did, where it's actually cheaper to rocket raid and save my AK from being destroyed, the village flew over, delivered me a rocket launcher and some rockets in order to assist me. How nice, right? Oh my god. Oh, look at these wires, dude. The wires are yours. Watch out. Uh, um, spice them, I don't know. Right, we've got the battery here. Okay, 4,000 sulfur. We found some sulfur at least, 4,000 of it. A bolty, a jackhammer, a python. Why is a half compound? Wow. Oh yes, boys. We got compost. I hadn't expected so many doors, so I went home with the sulfur I'd gotten to turn it into gunpowder to come back. However, by the time we came back, he had repaired but he hadn't removed the builder, which doesn't make any sense. So I went back in hoping he'd only place down one door. Okay. Oh, great. Oh man, he's repaired. 
kind of. He put a door down. Let's have a look. He's fucking repaired. I had well, let's, already let's, let's wasted so you only live much once, explosives right? on going through the ceiling doors. I decided I'm just going to go through where his legs are sticking out. And I probably should have done this originally. But if I did, I guess I wouldn't have found the uh, sulfur upstairs. So, instead, I went through this wall. 96. 23. I've oh, okay, got okay. nothing left. We found beds. However, this raid started with an eco raid, and well, it's going to continue with an eco raid. Wrong way round walls is what I like to see. Oh shit! Okay. So we found the way. We found the way to the core, man. I can give you the scrap to learn it. Why well, I, I feel like there's some other Uh huh? Is there another door? Yeah, I'm on this one. MP5 alert. I hear a body. You got TC. Oh, is this fucker? Go ahead. I'm gonna use our shooting floor. Uh, fuck all, man. Whoa, 14 springs? As far as raids go, this wasn't one of the greatest raids I've ever done. I should have stopped when I got the sulfur. However, 14 springs was pretty good for us as we, as a village, were really struggling with springs. It was shortly after this that we'd encountered the clan boys, the ones that are in the beginning of the video. Now, they live just over the next valley from us, so they're really close, and they just came out of nowhere overnight. And we hadn't noticed them until now, so we thought we'd pay them a little visit. That's an active base. They took heli. We're gonna cap it. We're gonna go on their roof. He's dead. Missing bags. Place another door. <laughs> they got scared. They're just placing doors. Why are they getting so scared? Yeah, it's full on honeycomb. Jump in. Go. We got bored. They were putting down extra doors, extra defenses. There was no way we would go deep on them now. So we thought we'd come back later. And yes, we do. And we do it in style. It's something exciting. Hope you enjoy it, guys. By this point, we'd compound to the two main bases, the community center and the heli tower base. And we're going to continue compounding every base in the village until we're all protected. Scrappy coming in. Scrappy coming in. I'm Scrappy. the Scrappy. Okay, okay. I'm, I'm just drawing fire. You guys sneak up on them. I was away from base with a scrap heli farming and some people had snuck up on the village and they were shooting down on it. So I hovered above them to distract them and to get the villagers to go and counter them. It was quite fun. Watch this. Directly in front of me, underneath. They go on coaster inland. Underneath, look this little base, inland. You hear it? Right underneath me, right underneath me. The base in front of me. The flame rate. There's another one. There's another one in front of me here, right underneath me. Yeah, I know, I know. The other one's where? Never. Come on, boys. They're fucking, they're stupid. They're giving away their position. These guys are now being chased by the villagers and they keep shooting the heli like they're gonna hit me. I'm above them, they can't hit me, they aren't very clever. The more they shoot, the closer the villagers get. 
hear You're AK. He's hiding in the trees. Hiding in the trees. Oh, sorry, I'm. No, don't worry, I'm gonna kill you as well. Still shooting at me. One dead. Nice. Landing. Two dead. Second nice. One dead. Second one dead. Great job, boys. Amira, and what's the other one's name? Take that armor set. Yeah, take it, take it. Regina. Uh, I found that thoroughly amusing. It's like one of those TV shows where the patrol helicopter's out telling the police officers where to go on ground. Just wish I had the night vision or the thermal radar. Do we want to go for that roof camper? I don't camper? think that guy had any clue I was sneaking up behind okay. him. Oh, there's a roof camper base, mate. It's a roof camper base. Yeah. Where am I getting shot from? During that whole chase, we were being shot at by roof campers. So I thought i will go and pay him a visit too. I want to mess with him you know i don't like roof campers it's something i actually never ever do and it's the most frowned upon thing in rust in my opinion other than cheaters of course no no hit yeah that one there on your left heavy is the one that i killed him on Lit straight up headshot you can take one of these guns and leave me here if you want I get the boys to leave me on the roof, making them think that we've all left just so I can go deep. Now, a lot of you guys say door camping is shit. In my opinion, if you door camp to go deep and not just ruin someone's day, there's a difference. Sitting outside someone's door, stopping them playing is a different thing. But trying to go into the base and get their stuff, that's different. Oh my god, that's three? That's three bodies. Maybe, maybe not, boys. I need, I need to go. I'm very low. He's still roof camping, and I don't get why. Because he's not even trying to go get the loot. It just doesn't make sense. I'm deep. Boys, come back. I'm deep. One door deep. Hold on, Sarek. I need to land here and heal up. Uh, if you want to go deeper, you continue. It's comms, comms, comms. Another door deeper. The boys arrive back in order to squeeze me through here. Yeah, keep going. Oh, yeah, come on. Keep them. Keep them. I'm pushing him while he's pushing. Keep them. Keep them. Yes. Take this bolt. Take this bolt. Can you give me your bolt? Can you get yeah. Okay, we're gonna leave you then, Sebe. Yeah, you can leave me if you want. Well, yeah, fuck it. The boys left, it became night, and it started becoming day again. I waited a whole 20 minutes for some action. Come for me, mate. Come on. Here we go. This is it. This time it's got a friend, guys. Because you can't get all the way down it. to me. Hang on, hold, hold on, hold on. No, no, not yet. Got spaz now. <laughs> After that, he stops us going any deeper and we leave. But I think the roof camper was taught a lesson. Well, actually, probably not. <laughs> Mate, for know. the record, I, I need to go soon, so if I leave, I'm not raging, okay? After that, I thought, well, let's go pay those other clan boys a visit and see how they're getting on. And it was getting late and I needed to go to sleep, but I just wanted one more bit of action. So I took two villagers and off we went. On top of their base. If there's a guy on the base, hover so I can MGL. I don't see anyone. Seems clear. Same side also isn't working. Doors, Doors open. open. Move, 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 move. He's dead. I'm going. 
Judging by the components on him, he was setting up the electricity on the roof and probably setting up the SAM site. If we'd been any later, we might have been shot down. Oh, fuck. Uh, yeah, right? <laughs> <laughs> he was just standing next to him. I think maybe it was AFK. Yeah, I think it was AFK. We dodged a bullet there. Here they come. Watch out! Here you go. Next episode, going deep. <laughs> CRV, someone's trying to open the roof. Alright, don't get my... Access yeah. to the... No they access to roof. Access we got roof. So. I can shoot an MGL in. Don't just, just careful. If they open. Yep. He can probably, yeah, he can probably kill him before they even think about shutting the door. This is what they get for shooting at us, bro. Like, seriously. Yeah, hit markers. Oh, he closed it. What? Got Fuck! Him. I'm full dead. Can I steal your mini? Can you drop me off? Can you drop me off somewhere? I don't think you that door, bro. So if you want to risk it, you can loot the front. No, right, so right, right. Oh my God. Up, Bro, up, so whoa, 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 whoa. My reflex, though. Watch the door, watch the door, watch the door, watch the door. What a nice land. Ready? Ready? Is that big heli? That's big heli. I'm gonna fly home and go take it? You can take it from here. Oh, <laughs> I'll cover. <laughs> That's, <laughs> That's, fucked. <laughs> That's fucked. Yeah, we're taking it from the enemy base. Oh, yeah, shotgun traps up. Okay, I see what they did there. They put like nine shotgun traps in that one spot. What the fuck? Me and Savvy killed him. I just had shot him twice. Well, that prevents us from going deeper. Oh, it doesn't. Savvy has ammo. Should have the rockets do it. Don't you? <laughs> oh, they closed it, you <laughs> bastards. <laughs> there goes the shotgun trap trick. <laughs> He's like, now what? <laughs> Tagged it. Incoming. This is so fucked. Somebody needs to stay on that door, though. I'm on the door. <laughs> We're raiding them. <laughs> Does it do damage to a base? I we one. don't. Oh, I just got GL, bro. Hey, he just yeah. That shit hurt. It hurted. It hurted. That's for damn sure. They use incense since we don't have TC, but it does hurt bases. Like people coming like towards money. us. There's people coming to the base. They just mentioned it in chat. Just what? There, there's people coming to the base. And, and they said it I'm in dead. Chat. I'm dead. I'm dead. Two Watch popped up at the same time. Okay. Fuck. Hey, can someone fly me back over to that base? Killed one. You're probably thinking, what a terrible idea trying to take heli while going deep in an enemy clan's base. It gives them the perfect opportunity to make a play on us. For bag up. Hey, I need to get Sora over to his base. I need to fly me back over to that base. Yeah, to the heli. Appreciate it. Uh, we're already in our way. Dropped one. Nice. There's at least two in yeah, there. Yeah, just drop me on the roof. Rockets! They're taking heli at an enemy base, which is funny. Dropped him. There goes our heli. We're gonna have to get Sora to come and help us. Heli's down. Good shit. Healing. Now it's really viable for him to come in. All right, careful. Hey, yeah, right. We need, we need, we need to help. We need evac to get the heli loot in a minute. <laughs> I've never taken heli from someone else's base while going deep on them. I know, right? <laughs> <laughs> I don't many people have. Period. Oh, they got a turret! It's empty and off, but... I found beds, alright. Cover, cover, cover beds, cover beds. I've got jackhammer, I've got jackhammer. You cover beds and one Hold cover... On, we need to cover the fellow door so they don't trap you in there. Holy fucking... 
Hey, hey, Avenger, help me cover this door. Yeah, they're coming from the road. Oh my god, we need evac! We need evac! Look okay, at the box! Okay. Oh my god. Great. Guys, guys, Someone stop looting! Go, go, cover door, cover door, cover door! Alright, boys, let, let's go to heli. He, let's go to the heli um, crash site. Quickly, heli crash site. Once everyone's on board. No, C4 yeah, no, rockets. C4 rocket. One more chest in there. Yeah, exp uh, ammo. I need to see all the loot on the table, man. I need to film it. I need to record Absolutely. it. I missed all of it. <laughs> <laughs> all right, guys. You know what? Chuck, chuck, chuck whatever was there on this, this guy's body. 20 gears. Three, four, a thousand There's sulfur. There's only six auto turrets. Was that it? Yeah. That's all there is. Seven. Yeah. And and the C C four rockets. Two C four, three ready. rockets. Hey, can nice. I borrow six high quality metals for a Guys, if, if I could high five in game, I would right now. <laughs> Now I have a lot more content in this village, but I don't want to use it because of stream snipers and I'm not going to credit stream snipers. I'm not going to think they can stream snipe and get in my videos. However, I do get the better of them and I'm going to show you how. But the lead up to this was me trying to get on cargo secretly. And just for context, I already know they're stream sniping. I don't know they're on cargo and they have admitted to it in my stream chat and in game chat calling me out. There you go, CRV. Help you out. Cheers, dude. But yeah, I was, uh, I was literally in bed, bro, getting ready to fall asleep. Comms. Me, like, hey. Comms, please, comms, please, comms, please. Yeah. <laughs> now, that on its own is not enough evidence, I know. But I then realized, well, I don't, one of the boys realized who it was. Now I'm going to just cover up his name tag because I don't want him to have the credit. But yeah, he admitted to me later that he checked my stream, saw what I was doing and went looking for me on cargo. That's why he came straight for me. Oh, dude, it's the screen snipers, bro. I then had a real smart plan because we'd already had an encounter with them. I knew where they live. Now these stream snipers were already established on the server, which is unfortunate for us. However, it also meant I knew where they lived and where they would be returning to. So, I turned off my stream picture but kept the sound on and I went and I waited for them to come back from cargo. Jesus Christ, <laughs> <laughs> oh, the, na the naked bailed. There's now a collection of four nakeds there. Listen. You keep, you keep getting killed, so does that not mean you should leave me alone? Stop trying to counter. Boat coming come in on, come on. It's them. Yep, it's them. Coming, coming close. They're going to get shot in their life if they come in there. Side, side, side. Pulling up, night, night. They've stopped. They're out. They're coming, night. I'm going to shoot in three, two, one. Kill them both. Fuck you, stream yep. snipers. They did not have any cargo loot on them. I think they were too late for cargo. And there we have the cargo loot. 81 HQM, face mask, another AK. And that brings the video to an end, guys. Thank you so much for watching. And once again, if you're not subscribed or you're new here, please do subscribe. 80% of you aren't subscribed. And if you're in the 20%, you are a bloody legend. Thank you so much, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. And make sure you come check me out on stream. And I'll be streaming the H-June tournament live tomorrow.